Uh, Julia Adler Milstein, um, I think, is the most effective, prolific researcher studying how do we actually use information technology to make care better. You know, the bottom line is that we have all sorts of problems with healthcare in our country, and information technology is going to play a critical role in figuring out how to help us deliver better care. Uh, but there's a big research agenda there of sorting out how do we make information technology a key part of performance improvement. We just don't know how to do it. And Julia has really been doing the cutting edge work in this area and teaching us all sorts of things about how to use information technology better. So a fundamental element of managed care is managing people with chronic illness, managing people with acute illness, figuring out how to deliver higher quality care. And Julia's work has taught us an incredible amount about things like how are national policy efforts in information technology affecting care. Um, at the organizational level, why is it that some organizations do so much of a better job in, in improving care than others? Uh, when it comes to use of information technology. Uh, she's taught us about the notion of complements, that there are organizational complements that affect how technology is used. Uh, she's opened up an entire field of study. So Julia is less than five years out of training, and if you look at her CV, it's more impressive than almost any full professor in America. And I expect that to only accelerate. When I look at the pipeline of the work that she has, I expect her to very quickly establish herself as one of the most prolific, if not the most prolific, uh, healthcare services and health delivery researchers in the country. Uh, I expect over the next three to five years, looking at her work, we're gonna learn a lot more about how to use information technology better, how to share data better, how to make organizations perform better in an IT-enabled world. Everybody has their own ideas for how to make quality better. Unfortunately, almost none of it is evidence-based. And so when we often struggle with why is it so hard to make care better, why is it so hard to take ideas from one place and transplant them to another, it's usually because there's not a good evidence base behind it. And really high quality research like the kind that Julia does uh, teaches us the lessons that are transportable, teaches us which lessons are really context dependent. It's fundamental to really making care better. So congratulations, Julia. You really are a prolific researcher. You are a terrific colleague and have increasingly become a really important teacher for me. You deserve this award and I'm thrilled that you got it. Congratulations.